Chris Sims, you're back. You know, you make a big ruckus on Thursday, and then you disappear on Friday, and I'm the one that's got to clean up your mess while you're angering Hall of Fame quarterbacks, while you're dissing other Hall of Fame quarterbacks. It's not about rings to me. I mean, again, yeah, I think Aaron Rodgers is the greatest quarterback I've ever seen. You've heard me say that. I think John Elway's number two, and I think Tom Brady's three. But a lot of people think I'm like, especially New England fans, think I'm being extremely disrespectful by saying that, or I don't like Tom Brady, by making him the third greatest quarterback of all time. You are not giving Brady nearly enough credit for his ability to process, find the guy, and deliver the football. Look at those highlights. You know, we put so much stock in mobility. Tom Brady doesn't need mobility. No, because because the first guy's always open, Mike. The first guy's always open. But but he knows who to throw it to. So do all the other quarterbacks. They're just not open like that. Well, because they don't have the greatest coach ever in the history of the NFL, and it's not even close. If they don't have... Sunday ticket. How many people out there instantly call up DirecTV and say, come get your stuff. I'm done. Let's appreciate that he is answering the question once again and not giving us some token BS. You know, I understand but what this you're... is token. This is token BS. Well, this is just talk. Oh, OK. This is not... What is it? Oh, I couldn't reach my full potential in New York. What are you talking about? You're a football player. You well, live in one of the greatest cities in the world. Well, you reach your full potential there. We always if you can't that. reach your full potential there. You can't reach it anywhere. Yeah, or oh, OK, what are you, Frank Sinatra <laughs> over there? Get out of here. <laughs> Big booties, fifteen hundred dollars cash. Flight from France, sorry, negative Ghost Rider. I got a bug flying around me. Negative Ghost Rider, I don't think I'd take that offer. I think Cam would have to offer me more to move move my damn seat. How much would it take? If I got 3,000 cash, I'd probably be like, okay, I could deal, see ya. I mean, definitely anything north of that, I'm all in. But other than that, man, 10 hours, not being able to stretch my legs out, yeah, you better make it make it worth my while. All I know is this, for 1500 bucks, that's $150 an hour, and I'm not going anywhere anyway.